What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? <laughs> what's up, Sunseeds? What's up? This your girl, Mystic Sunflower. I'm back to give you guys a collective general energy reading. It doesn't matter what your sign is, Sunseeds, for this message to resonate. Please make sure you're using discernment. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. Also, be mindful this can be past, present, or future. Okay? Sunseeds. I got some cards that fell out. Okay? So, I wanted to clarify the cards. And I, I wound up using my truth deck because when i was putting on my deck for my last reading these cards fell out so someone is in regret whoever this person is they are in a lot of regret right now and we have feminine so divine feminine and mercury which is, speaks about communication somebody wants to message you okay and we have guilt and, and sabotage so somebody's in guilt because they sabotage a connection with you, but they spying and watching. This person spies and watch and watch you. Okay. Um, I asked Spirit with the truth that clarify the regret card and relationship came out. So this person is in a lot of regret about this relationship. Okay. This person could have chose someone over you. This person could have neglected this relationship. They could have self-sabotaged themselves out of a beautiful connection with you. But listen to this. The feminine and Mercury, um, uh, Mercury messages and communication and travel. I experienced to clarify this. It came out with message. <laughs> so whoever this is, divine feminine, they want to divine feminine, divine masculine. You know, there's no gender, but this is what came out. This person wants to speak to you. This person wants to message you about a relationship. Okay, about something that whatever they holding this guilt in about whatever this regret is about. I asked Spirit to clarify guilt and self, um, guilt and sabotage. Air sign came out. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. You could be Aquarius, Libra, Gemini or dealing with Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. I asked Spirit to clarify spying and watching. Immature and trust came out. So whoever this person is spying, that's spying is watching you, this person knows that they was very immature. Okay? This was someone that you felt like you could not trust at all. Okay? Spirit, give me another card on this regret and relationship. Why is this person in regret in this relationship? Yeah, look. Can't make it up. Cheating and deception. Somebody was lying and they were cheating in a, in a connection with you guys. Now somebody is tripping over you, Divine Feminine. They want to message you. They want to talk to you. Somebody could um, be wanting to apologize to you. Somebody could be writing you a long letter. Okay. Or be writing you a long text message, your email. Take it how it resonates. Whatever way how you guys um, usually communicate. Spirit, give me a card on this double message. What's these two message cards for Divine Feminine? What is these two messages cards? Please and thank you. Yeah, the messages. I can't make it up. Reconciliation. The reason why this person wants to message you because they want to reconcile. Okay, this person wants another, yeah, insecurities. This person, because I picked up earlier, somebody's self sabotage connection. This person was definitely very Im um, immature. They was insecure. Uh, maybe this person sees you as a threat. Okay, um, maybe this person was intimidated by you, divine feminine, because you're someone who's very strong, um, very beautiful, um, inside and out. Someone who's very bold and courageous. And somebody could have been intimidated by that. Whoever this immature person is. Message was clarified. The reconciliation and insecurities. This person is insecure. Okay, I don't care how they come off. Don't let this person fool you. This person was insecure about this whole connection. This person is also insecure about um, hitting you up or not. Because somebody could feel like you don't want this anymore. Give me a card on this um, guilt and air sign. Guilt and air sign, Holy Spirit. What's this guilt and air, air sign? It's complicated. Somebody could be dealing with a fire sign. Or this person could have just been real cold to you. Okay? Somebody could have done something out of lust. And they self-sabotage the connection. And now they're in regret. Mm. I'm hearing something could have happened to this person. Maybe something happened to this person that humbled them. What's this? What's this? It's complicated, Holy Spirit. It's complicated. Yeah. Realization. Mm. 
Whatever was complicated before, this person is now realizing something. They seeing somebody seeing how immature they were. Somebody knows the reason why you don't trust them. Mm. Somebody is something happened to this person where this person is now seeing their ways. What's this immature? Immature Holy Spirit. Thank you. Yeah, avoidance. Somebody was avoiding growing up. Somebody was avoiding doing the healing, doing the work. They was avoiding. Somebody was fighting it. Now somebody is being forced to grow up. What's this trust? What's this trust, Holy Spirit? We got two cards. Trust came out with Dayton and water sign. You could be dealing with a Cancer Pisces Scorpio or you could be a Cancer Pisces Scorpio. But somebody, somebody definitely could have went through some type of awakening. But whoever this person is, they're coming in because they want to date you. They want to court you. Um, this Whoever this water sign is, somebody's in love. Somebody's in love, and they, and they and they trying to figure out how they with this spy and watching, and inspecting. This person wants to uh, somebody trying to figure out how they could gain your trust back. Mm. What's the insecurity, so this bear? What's this insecurities? Insecurities. What's this insecurities? Please and thank you. They're hurting. Somebody know that they self sabotage the connection, a relationship that could have been very beautiful. They lied, they cheated, they was immature, they was very deceptive when it came to this relationship. And now this person wants to come back and reconcile with you. They want to communicate with you. They want to express their feelings. But um, this person is uh, somebody is scared. I'm picking up on. Somebody is scared. Give me a card. Was it cheating and deception? What's the cheating and deception? Yeah, cheating and deception is clarified with apology. This person wants to apologize to you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because they could have felt for some type of temptation. Yeah. Waiting and no contact. For some of you guys, this person could have been waiting for you to reach out to them, Sun Seeds. But they seeing that that's not happening. Somebody is realizing that they have to make the first move. But some of you guys, this person feels like you're not even interested. You're not even you're not even thinking about them. You're not even going to consider even giving this person another chance. Yeah, unconditional love. Somebody is remembering when you had unconditional love. Mm -hmm. And they hoping you still feel the same about this romance. Yeah. But damn, they feel like you're walking away, Sunsees. They feel like you're walking away. Yeah, distance. For a lot of you guys, it could this person could um, be at a distance, live overseas, or it could just be a lot of distance between you guys. Okay. I feel like in this distance, this person been trying to distract themselves a lot to keep their mind off of the situation, but somebody can't take it no more. Yeah, you was very natural with this person. Something that was very organic. You was very organic. That's why it's eating this person up the way it is. This person finds you very attractive as well. But this person is hurting. They hurting because they let their insecurities get the best of them by being so immature. And now this person wants to come back. Um, this person could have definitely did some type of work on themselves. But somebody had to grow up. With this immature and trust, this person wants you to see them a different way. When this person contacts you, this person, my nose itching. This person wants you to see them a different way. They want you to trust them. Trust that they have changed. Okay? Whatever they was fighting and whatever they was avoiding before, now somebody is ready. Somebody with this realization, now somebody knows. Somebody realized the truth of the matter. And, and the truth is, is that this person is in love with you. And they can't fight it no more. But this person also know that they gotta they gotta come in heal. They gotta come in a better version um than what they were, you know, before in the past. This person could have um was dealing with a karmic. That could have helped giving this person some type of realization. This person could have felt a temptation when it came to a karmic. I'm hearing this person saying that they're going to find you. So I don't know if you moved away. But some of you guys, you could have moved away. But somebody is saying that they're going to find you. What's this realization? Holy Spirit, what's this realization? Somebody loves how naturally beautiful you are. How organic you are. Yeah, the realization is new love. But some of you guys, this person could have given a commitment to someone else. Okay, chose someone else over you. And now somebody is seeing the truth about who they gave a commitment to. Yeah. 
Something backfired on this person. It did. And now somebody realizing. Somebody feels like you are just you single, you happy, you living your bestest life. Maybe you might be going out with your friends, traveling, or just spending time by yourself. What's this new love? I'm hearing you not um I'm hearing you um you resting. You you're not stressing over anything. The new love is clarified with quality time. So maybe you guys have moved on to new love and spent a quality time with that person. Independent. This gives me the nine of pentacles. Maybe you guys are single and just getting to know someone else that you're interested in. Okay. Yeah, happiness. Mm. And maybe you guys are taking it slow because of what you have gone through in the past. Ooh. Yeah, some of you guys could be getting to know someone and just taking it slow, okay? But you get very interested in this person. This person make you happy. You spend a lot of quality time with this person. And this person, ugh, that's this person's, like, worst nightmare. What's this slow, not ready, Holy Spirit? What's this slow, not ready? What's this slow, not ready, Holy Spirit? Please and thank you. Yeah, healing. The reason why this person wasn't ready for... Um, this connection before is because they were, you know, um, they was they was fighting the healing process. So this person went to something that, you know, was um, it was less work. They didn't have to work hard, you know. Whoever they felt a temptation temptation for, they didn't have to put in no work. Somebody just wanted them just just for who they were because that person was low vibrational, just like them. For some of you guys who are are actually now dating someone with this new love. I feel like the reason why you guys are taking it slow because you guys could still be in the process of healing. Mm -hmm. Can I have a card on the um, independent? Independent. Ooh. Somebody want to take you off the market. Somebody's scared that this new love. But somebody, ooh, chill. Independent and proposal of marriage. So some of you, oh, wow. Somebody wants to marry you. Somebody's in love with you, and they praying that you're not with nobody new. Ooh, they praying that you're not with nobody new. Yeah, whoever this sneaky person is that put you in a third party situation, um, that you share chemistry with. Somebody is feeling ooh. Somebody is, is trapped in their own games and their own cycles that they was playing. Somebody got caught up in a situation. Mm. But some of you guys, whoever you date, whoever this new love is, um, it's gonna lead to a high level, um, a high level commitment. Mm -hmm. Somebody felt for temptation. Okay, and they missing you. They want you back. This person's in a lot of regret. That's why they scared to communicate with you. Because they could, they could feel like if there's a possibility that you know, okay, that this person um, gave a commitment to somewhere else. Um, it's a